How you doing, buddy? You shaking hands today? All right. All right, first of all, tell me what happened to your knee. It's sore, right? Yes, sir, it is. It's, it, it swells up real bad. Mm -hmm. But yeah. you did something silly the other day, right? What'd you do the other day? You told me you did something. No, I was taking the trash out. Yeah. Isn't that your and wife's job? Isn't she I supposed stepped, to take the trash out? I stepped in a hole. <laughs> Just kidding. Where, uh, <laughs> so you stepped in a hole. When 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 we got flooded, mm -hmm. okay, oh. the people started coming on my yard. Okay, throwing Instead stuff of out through the water. They come through. They drove. Yard. They drove on the yard. Okay, so they and made they ruts. All them ruts. Yeah. Okay, I got it. I'm going to call you Oscar for our video. Oscar, are you okay if we make a little video of your procedure here yes, today? Yes, it is. All right, we were just talking a few minutes ago. There's one muscle in the body that crosses two joints. It's called the sartorius. In your case, it originates on the pelvis, crosses the femur, and it inserts down here on the tibia. Now, you stepped into a hole and you strained your knee, but your knee is okay. This is not a knee problem. It's a bursa problem right down there where we poked, remember? Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a soft okay. tissue injection, and we're going to put a little cortisone in there. And we're going to see if we can get you feeling better. You okay with that? Yes. You sure? Now you got a Vietnam me a veteran hat on. Oh, I'm a veteran. You're a veteran? <laughs> yeah. And you also told me that uh, you had cancer. Prostate cancer. Were you exposed to Agent Orange? Yes. You were. That's what I was wondering. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you're okay. How many how many rounds of radiation? Well, it depends on your definition of okay, right? Yeah. I think you're. I'm glad you're. I'm glad you're still here I, I, with us. Let's I put take, it that way. I take so much medication, you know, I just. We'll make a little dimple here, okay? You're gonna feel a little dimple. You can say "ow" if it hurts, but not too loudly. How was that? That wasn't too bad. Sometimes you know, I just. I can't feel. Yeah, things go numb, right? Well. I thank you for your service. Well, thank you very much, sir. You are welcome. And here it is. I bet did you? I bet you lost a lot of friends. Right here it is after Memorial Weekend. But you know, it's surprising. You just walked in and you said what was wrong. Oh well, <laughs> it's just what I do. That's my job, right? I'm supposed yes. to know what's wrong. If I don't know what's wrong, hopefully. If I don't know what's wrong, then you, you came to the wrong place, right? <laughs> All right. Well, let's see if we can get you feeling better. All right. So I'm going to kind of squat down here. Gummy Jean's going to spray some cold spray on that. Here it comes. That's going to make it feel chilly. And then I'm going to make a little shot right there. There we go. And then down a wee bit. How's that feeling? It's okay. Hurt a little bit. A little bit sorry. of a little sting. That's okay. But not bad, right? Okay, how's that feel now when I push on it? Does that seem to hurt a little bit less? Okay, mm -hmm. good. Getting a head nodding here. Now go ahead and straighten your leg out a couple of times. How's that feel now? Seem to feel better? Oh, yeah. yeah it's it's a a mm -hmm. Pretty amazing, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. He's all surprised. Like, yeah. how'd this guy know? <laughs> all right. You know how I knew? Because your knee wasn't hot. You know, I know you've had a history of knee trouble, but this was a very particular kind of injury. A shot in the knee would not have helped this, okay? Okay. So this is pes anserine bursa, and you had a pes anserine bursitis, which is an inflammation of the bursa, and we gave you a little cortisone shot. Now, that's actually technically not a joint injection. That's a soft tissue injection, okay? So tonight, though, I want you to ice this area for about 20 minutes. Do it about an hour before you go to bed. Yeah. Mr. Oscar. I know Oscar's not your real name. Hey, we appreciate you letting us uh, make a little video. We had a good time. Okay. You're a good fella. I don't care what your wife told me earlier. <laughs> you're all right. Because you're the one who makes me feel better. <laughs> all right, man. See you later. Okay. Action. Hey, guys. I'm going nowhere. The medicine video is coming right up. And okay. Wait. No, we're going. <laughs> <laughs> okay, come on, tell us about Meta 7, for real. Um, I love it. It really does. It uh, helps me focus. It gets me going. Uh, wakes me up a little bit in the morning. It doesn't give me any jittery kind of feeling. Um, yeah, it just, it's just kind of an, makes me feel balanced. Not sleepy, but not too awake. Not like a caffeine rush. 
I just feel good. Makes you feel natural. Yes. Makes you feel alert. And awake. natural, happy, alert. Yeah. Yep. It keeps me focused on uh, any anything that I'm working on, uh, tasks at the office, things at home that I'm trying to get done. I just I feel like I'm able to get more into my day. Good. That's awesome. So, Thanks. You're welcome. If you'd like to get an extractor kit of your own, we did some looking around and came up with this one. It's compact, has steel instruments that won't corrode like a lot of the cheaper sets, but the price is very reasonable too. Good variety of tools and just an all around solid kit. Use the Amazon link below and it ships quickly from the US. So you won't have to wait long before you start popping. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button, we've got new content all the time.